Good morning. Today is Friday, and we've been putting in the work this week. I am so proud of each of you for courageously concentrating every day on each of your assignments. We are going to end this week on a fantastic note. Let's get started with the morning announcements. Good morning, Silly Kids Elementary students and staff. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, and with liberty and justice for all. Please remain standing for the Bobcat Affirmation. Bobcat Affirmation. Bobcats are powerful. I think positively. I take ownership of my actions. I make wise choices. I am excited about new learning. I will reach my goals. I forgive others and myself. I am understanding the differences. I am a leader. I am a bobcat. This has been Mila Adams from Mr. Kane's class. Remember, at Cine Hills Elementary School, every student counts and every moment matters. Stay tuned for the Bobcat Bobcats. Now, every day, all of the Bobcats within our Cine Hills School should strive to display our foundational values. In order to do this, you must think about the three R approach, which is to be respectful, be responsible, and to always be ready to learn. In today's Classroom Spotlight, we would like to shine a light on our grade three through five step class and our grade three through five clue scholars who were caught courageously concentrating on their assignments on yesterday which means that they were showing all three of our school-wide foundational values of being respectful responsible and ready to learn Today, we have two scholars celebrating their birthdays. We want to wish a very special birthday to Terrion Campbell and Aiden Jones. Scholars, we are so, so excited to have both of you at school with us today so that we can shower you with birthday wishes. We hope that this day brings you everything that makes you smile. If you are in the room with these two very special scholars, I want you to turn around, point at them, and say, Happy Birthday! Now, scholars, we have had a lot of extra special announcements this week, so we have not had the opportunity to announce our top three grade levels, our I Ready All Star grade levels in reading and mathematics. Now, we have two separate 
separate groups this week as we had some grade levels that pulled away from the others so we will be announcing three grade levels for reading and three grade levels for math today i hope i wonder will your grade level make the cut let's find out coming in third place for the week of february the 14th through 18th for having the highest lesson pass rate in reading our third place grade level is grade five congratulations fifth grade we are so proud of the work that you are doing keep it up in second place with the second highest lesson pass rate in reading for last week were our grade three scholars grade three scholars you are making the best of your time in intervention and you are paying attention to every single skill and every single question and you are in second place i know that you will work extra hard this week so that you can be in first place on next week you still have one more day one more day to help your grade level move to first place next week and our reigning champions for having the achieving the accomplishing the highest lesson pass rate in reading we have our first grade scholars first grade scholars you have been in first place for two months two months that is amazing you are amazing keep up the great work and in mathematics coming in third place with the third highest lesson pass rate in mathematics we have our grade four scholars grade four welcome to the top three we are so proud of you and our second place for the second highest pass rate in mathematics goes to our grade two scholars grade two scholars you are rocking it out in mathematics congratulations we couldn't be prouder of the work you are doing keep it up remember that every scholar every scholar counts in the race to be in first place so you have one more day one more day only one more day 45 more minutes to help your grade level to make it to first place on next week make sure that you are paying close attention to those lessons each week because you could be that one lucky scholar who helps your grade level to move up a place and level up and maybe make it to first place next week let's find out who our first place is in mathematics let's find out now i cannot believe it oh my god congratulations goes to our grade one scholars they are not only first place in reading but they took the top spot in mathematics too first grade scholars do you know that you have the highest pass rate in mathematics on i ready for the past week wow this is amazing astonishing super fantastic fantastic awesome terrific i i i don't even know what to say i'm speechless i i'm i'm so proud i'm so excited i know that you will continue to concentrate because you know those other grade levels are coming for you so you have to continue to be excellent 
every day. Each time you have your tablets in front of you, you are at that desktop computer. Each time you open up an iReady lesson, you must be nothing less than excellent if you want to remain in first place you have been in first place for two months straight two months straight that is a long time to be in first place i know you can continue this streak i am so proud we're gonna have to give you some kind of certificate some kind of plaque we are going to have to do something very special because two months that is a very very special milestone congratulations 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 goes to each of our grade levels who made the cut you are our i ready all stars for this week keep up the great work we can't wait to see if first place will be able to hold on to the top spot or will there be a grade level that makes sure that every scholar is concentrating so that you can push them out of this space and bring your grade level to the top we shall see hmm can't wait to find out you have one more day one more day to help your grade level make it into the i ready all stars for next week in reading and mathematics will you be able to do it i think you can do it i can't wait to see how you are courageously concentrating because you can do it i believe in you i know that you will help your grade level to make it into the all-star club next week in our school-wide events and activities scholars this is just a reminder that on monday we will stream our second quarter honors program and our spring family data night via our youtube page that is monday tell your parents to go to at scenic hills bobcats at six o'clock on monday so that they can watch the virtual honors program and our spring family data night our second announcement for today is that we are on our week five theme for the read to achieve grizzlies and internationals paper um, literacy challenge so our theme for this week is going for the goal scholars five weeks ago each of you received a read to achieve bookmark which stated that your goal was to read six books in six weeks you should be on book number five book number five is free choice you should be reading book number five once you finish with book number five you should have your parents your guardian your aunt your uncle your grandmother whoever is with you when you read in the evenings that is who should initial your bookmark now we are on the fifth week that means next week is our last week i can't wait to see which scholars will have all six weeks initialed have you been writing down the title of the books that you have been reading each week if you have not you still have time to go back and write down the other four books that you have read so far so that you can turn your bookmark in and get a prize on at the end of our next week now the next week will not end on a friday because scholars if you remember we had those ice i think we had ice and a snow day so uh the weeks end on Tuesdays. So our week, so our week six will not end until Tuesday, March the eighth. 
Tuesday, March the 8th, will mark the end of our six weeks for the Grizzlies Read to Achieve. Now, scholars, lastly, I have one very special announcement. Today, we want to congratulate one of our own Bobcats who is doing great things in our community. So, we want to give a special shout out to our grade five scholar, Marzi Short. She was featured in the Stax Music Academy's virtual Black History Concert. The Stax Virtual Black History Concert. It was streamed about 10 days ago live for all the world to see. We'll watch a small snippet and teachers, I'll email a link if you would like for your class to watch the entire uh, virtual Black History uh, program that was brought to us by the Stacks Music Academy. We are so proud of you, Marzi. We now understand all those different hairstyles that you wore as you were practicing to perform in this 45 minute long concert. She is doing great things. We couldn't be prouder. She is making everyone look at the great things that we have happening at the hill. Keep up the great work. back to telling the story of african-american music two music forms that remember every day we're building brilliant bobcats because we are raising the bar by believing in ourselves achieving our goals and reimagining our future 
We will conclude our announcements with our victory roar. Say it with me. Together we must believe. Together we will achieve. Together we are reimagining 901. Have a fantastic day of teaching and learning.